decision making is a big part of the process. One of the things I'm looking for if I find myself in close proximity, especially once I become entangled in the clinch and I begin my clinch fighting and wrestling, you'll see when we get to this, when possible and when tactically advantageous, I like to get that person on the ground. Now, at IDS, for self-defense, we prefer not to use takedowns. Takedowns typically mean that we're going to the ground with them. We prefer not to go to the ground with our adversary. One, there's more than one lethal weapon in play. You have to worry about retaining and accessing your weapon while they have a knife on the ground. That's, that's, a, bad, that's a bad situation. Second, dangerous surfaces. The surfaces itself could harm you inadvertently. You don't want to harm yourself by taking somebody down and going to the ground with them. Three, we don't know what their skill level is. Now they may have a very high skill level on the ground and now you're at a, at a disadvantage. Who knows why? Maybe you're already injured. Who knows what the circumstances call for? Four, I think it's four, right? There's a 56% chance of more than one attacker. So chances are good if you go to the ground, it's gonna be easy pickings for whoever their friends are to intervene to come hurt you while you're tangled up on the ground with them. We prefer to have the high ground. We wanna stay mobile and have the high ground while we get them on the ground. That's why we prefer what we call dumps, trips, and sweeps. We remain standing while we take them to the ground when it's tactically advantageous.